one fall. Introducing first the challenger from Toledo, Ohio, Trey Miguel. It was a milestone moment for Trey Miguel when he captured his first X Division title at the Bound for Glory event in 2021. And speaking of which, we will be live once again in October for the 18th annual Bound for Glory pay-per-view. Stay tuned to Impact Wrestling for ticket and city information. Tonight here in Atlanta, it's Trey Miguel who's got a brilliant opportunity to capture the championship once again. And you can capture the brand new Venom Trey shirt at Shop Impact. As you see the jacket he's wearing there, he's a little bit of the Spidey, a little bit of the Venom. He wants to recapture all of that gold and glory here at Against All Odds. unable to compete here in America. And it was at Ultimate X, at Slammiversary, that he made it all worthwhile, capturing the X Division Championship. One of the questions I have is, will he still be the champion by the time we get to Louisville, Kentucky, two weeks from tonight, as Impact Wrestling presents the Derby City Rumble. It'll be on Friday, July 15th, and Saturday, July 16th. Tickets are on sale now at impactwrestling.com. He has a very, very motivated opponent in Trey Miguel, who puts a lot of personal pride on holding that Impact X Division Championship. The first Against All Odds event saw the great AJ Styles retain the X Division Championship against another Impact original, Christopher Daniels, who was a 30-minute Iron Man match in which Styles won it two to one in overtime. These two men looking to add to the fantastic lineage of the X Division title. What intensity here. Bailey offering the hand, a sign of respect. more venom than anything else tonight. And it's less of a lack of respect and more of just an intensity, a desire, a fire burning inside Trey Miguel. That is the whole entire X Division. That's what it means to him. Going after the arm there, Bailey. Very smart here by Miguel early on. Championship can only change hands via pinfall or submission inside the ring. It can't happen via count out or disqualification. But you can do a heck of a lot of damage on the outside of the ring. This that's what Brian Myers was able to do earlier on that countdown whoa, 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 to whoa, against whoa, all whoa. odds. Oh, capturing the digital media title from Rich Swan. Did you see that incredible action? Trey Miguel flying over the ropes into that side oh. elbow takedown. But ultimately cut off at the pass by Mike Bailey. The This moonsault run to the outside. And how Mike Bailey doesn't break both ankles every time he does that is beyond me not wrestling in boots. I am constantly astounded at our X Division champion. This is the 11th against all odds event in the history of Impact Wrestling. First back in 2005, ran annually for 2012. It's since been brought back in 2019 and 2021. But look at that, that shot right there to the knee. Mike Bailey, that looks critical. And after that incredible flurry of offense from the champion, oh, oh, you could see just a little bit of bend there. Just a little bit of that bend, and you saw the agony in the eyes of Mike Bailey. Oh, and for someone who relies so much on his martial arts background, those incredible kicks and a, you know, athletic displays, this is going to be devastating for Mike Bailey. This is very smart here by Trey Miguel. He's got to be the aggressor early on here. If you let Bailey build momentum, he's damn near impossible to stop. Oh, look at that. Look at Bailey trying to flip away. Here's a cover and a kick out. Miguel held on. Trey Miguel holding onto the leg of Mike Bailey. The way he held on to the X Division Championship when it was around his waist. 
That's how much the title means to him. He, you see the desperation in his eyes. You see it burning in his soul. That's what he needs to get back. Oh, and now goes to the no. knee. Return fire here from Mike Bailey. Oh, and now the left knee. A dragon screw by Bailey. Driven straight in the mat as well. Now tying up the legs of Trey like a pretzel. Uh -oh, uh -oh. Oh! Snapping him right down into this leg lock. And you see the agony in the deep blue eyes of Trey Miguel tonight as he desperately reaches for the ropes. Are we going to see a submission here for Bailey in defense of his championship and against all odds? Miguel screaming out in pain, trying to get to the bottom rope. The damage has been done, but he gets to the bottom rope. Referee is forced to break the hole. And now both athletes have had their legs targeted. Remember, Bailey's only singles loss here in Impact Wrestling is to Trey Miguel. It was the episode before Slammiversary on Access TV just a few weeks ago. I have to imagine now, as an X Division champion, he would like to right that wrong. Oh, look at that. Kicking with the injured left leg. I mean, sometimes it just comes out of instinct. You're not, you're not intending to, but you're so used to that kind of offense. Oh! Went for something big there, and again, the knee went into the canvas in the process. Same thing. You might look at that and well, why would you do that? Why would you do that? But athletes operate so much on instinct, just like Trey is doing there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I have a feeling it's going to be a lot of back and forth with these guys attacking each other's legs and then forced to do different kinds of offense. Every step has got to be agonizing for these two men. All it takes is a small tweak of the knee to throw everything off, especially when you're this kind of athlete in the X Division here. High flying, high intensity. Miguel, of course, last night on Access TV, winning a fatal four-way match, become the number one contender to the title. Oh, and look at him wrap up Bailey here. A German suplex leg tied in there as well. As, oh, can't even get the momentum on the run going. Bailey, Bailey trying to unload here. Oh, and attacks. And now Speedball. Oh, he went for the knees and it looked like to a degree right off that Mikhail blocked it, but I don't know who got the better of it. This is so fascinating. Watch this. Bailey drops the knee, but Miguel puts up the knee. Both have had their knees injured and attacked. So both smart and incredibly painful moves and counters. It's almost a matter of what do you do at this point? The offense is agony. The counter is agony. How much are you willing to sacrifice for the X Division Championship? Spoke about maybe they would try some alternative offense, but it seems like they're both gonna grin and bear it, gut it out, put everything on the line, stick to their game plan, to what they know they do the best. Here's the interesting thing, right? Bailey kicks with his left, Miguel kicks with his right. So Bailey has got a good plant leg, however, you deliver the strike, that's gonna hurt. And then for Trey Miguel, you have virtually nothing behind your kick with the right because your plant leg, the left is taken away. Absolutely. The battle of what is the lesser evil? What is the lesser evil greater pain in this scenario? So Bailey's shaking his head. I, I think both these men are astonished by how much pain the other one is willing to endure. Oh, God, that one took Bailey clean off his feet. And you see, that's what they're both doing. They're both simply targeting the leg again at this point. Seeing who will give first. Look at the intensity on the face of the champion. Trying to stay up right here, now firing off these kicks on their damaged left legs. The intensity is off the charts. The agony is off the charts. But Bailey is desperate to hold on to his championship. Another dragon screw at the hands of Miguel.
At this rate, whose leg is gonna snap first? Now it's Miguel, he's going to the strikes with his hands. Oh, the upper body offense here. Trying to mix things up a little bit there, was trying to turn around. Speedball Mike Bailey. Sunset flip, oh, thought about a cover. the double knees here again. Oh, look at Miguel, he got his knees up, barely anticipated it. Oh, no! Prevented Miguel from getting any sort of defense prepared. Miguel was looking for that same counter he hit before. Take a look at the Bailey switch positions. Nailing the back of Trey Miguel. More damage to his own leg, but Trey Miguel is now on the defensive. The old adage where you're willing to go through hell to get to heaven. And I'll tell you this, both these athletes are willing to go through hell. They've already done it so far in this matchup. No way. Oh my God, look at this. this. And the torque looking for the impact there in the corner. Now it's McGill over for the title. Kick out by Bailey. I'm surprised Mike Bailey was able to hit those twists. Almost not able to lift Bailey up on that one. You see his knee almost gives way oh. right at the end there, grabbing his knee, couldn't quite capitalize on it. And now it's just about who can hit that finishing blow, who can put an end to this agony. Look at Miguel, very gingerly going to the top turnbuckle here. Is he thinking about the meteor? The pain just declined. Oh, he's going for me. Could have been catastrophic any way that he hit it. Yeah, even if he would have connected with that one, but he had the ability, the energy to get the cover, but unfortunately misses trying to desperately get some feeling back in that leg. The 
these guys got to hope that they can walk tomorrow morning because they've been running through hell all night. But Trey Miguel, it'll be all worth it if he's got the X Division title in his hands at the end of this matchup. The top rope by Bailey. Oh! Shot there to the right leg, but it's the neck and the head of Bailey that went into the canvas. These two have been laser focused on the leg of the other this entire matchup. And, and look at this, Bailey's trying to pull himself up so he can prevent Miguel from doing anything here. But look at Miguel. Oh! It's a little too long. Bailey was waiting for him. He kicked the knees, took out the base of Miguel. What is this? Oh my god. Look at that smell of the ring. Oh! Cover! Bailey retains! Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner, and still X Division Champion, Speedball Mike Bailey! Once again, the fans are on their feet here at center stage in Atlanta. What a classic! And you take a look here, the knees on the apron into the guts and ribs of Trey Miguel. But still the pain on the face of Mike Bailey. With this, if you're a fan of Mike Bailey and you've seen this elsewhere in his career, that's the Flamingo driver. He knew there was so much damage done to his knee, he couldn't go back to Ultimate Weapon, so he pulled something else out of his arsenal. And yet still, despite that, despite the fact that he was even able to stand to hit that is an impressive.